At one point, Chris's character insults yours by calling you a Ken doll. Which is not an insult <laughs> at all. It's not. I'm proud of that. You, you now are playing Ken. Yeah, well, I have that Ken energy. <laughs> sure do. That he could feel, obviously, mm. when you commented on it and, you know. It's, uh, I, I still feel like the Kennergy is alive and... Can you explain the Kennergy for me? I can't, you'll, you, I mean, you, did you know what I mean? No? Well, your lovely wife you, said You know a Ken in your life and then you oh. know that that Ken has Kennergy. Has Kennergy. Well, it's the Kennesance per It's the Kennesance, yeah. <laughs> did, <laughs> did you love that she coined that term for you? I loved it. I thought it was, um, I, I loved it. <laughs> I love that she's got love for Ken. That means a lot to me. You know, Margot Robbie told us, whatever we think the yeah. Barbie movie is, it's not that. Right. How would you tease the movie or respond to that quote? I think I would never correct Barbie. Sure. I would never dream of it. I would say whatever Barbie says is exactly right. She's what? right. If you, it's not what you think it is, unless it is. What is and it? And then you know what it is, and then it, but, but I don't think that's what you think it is. What is it? Wait, what are we talking about? The Barbie movie. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm excited. Are you? Yes. I mean, it's, people are going uh, nuts for the photos of it. I can't, I can't wait. That's nothing. That's nothing. I can't wait for people to see the film. It's Give me one not word. what you expect. <laughs> it's not what you expect. <laughs> one word? That's, that's, that's all I can say. Okay. <laughs> Otherwise Mattel will come in and box me up. <laughs> well, that's kind of the point. Or is it? I don't know. <laughs> what um, are you talking about? <laughs> Which role then maybe were you more buff for, the gray man or Barbie? Because we see Ken's abs. Right. Right. Yeah, that Ken life is, that Ken life is, it's, that's, it's, it's even harder than the, than the gray man life, I think. Really? Yeah. In what ways? He's got, Ken's got no money, he's <laughs> got no job, he's got no car, he's got no house. Wow. You know. Okay. He's going through some stuff. Wow, maybe the Renaissance isn't what we thought it was. Maybe it's time. <laughs> Has Ava seen any of the movie? What does she think of it? Well, I can't, I can't okay. comment for her. <laughs> but she has seen some of the film, yeah. They have something they really want. What's your gut? It's gonna be my funeral you're going to next. You wanna make an omelet? You gotta kill some people. The movie's so good. I don't know how else to say it. I didn't breathe for two hours oh. because of the action, but I breathed when I laughed, which was often. Uh -huh. So it's just so great. So thank you for making a great, fun movie to watch. Oh, cool. <laughs> thank you. It was fun. Um, it was you fun and Chris, to you're great together. Uh, you know, we were thinking, I'm like, you have had some amazing chemistry with your leading co stars over the years Emma Stone, Miss mm. Ava Mendes. Thank you. How is the chemistry with you and Chris Evans? How does it compare? It doesn't compare to the, to the <laughs> mine with uh, with Ava um, <laughs> at all. It doesn't chart. But he, uh, you know, Chris ran mustache first into this role. He had a lot of fun playing it. Sure did. And it made it fun to play against. You know. Did you think about growing a mustache after seeing his? Oh no. No. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Is that in? I mean, you two, the, the combat sequences mm. are just captivating. What was the training like for this role to get in shape for that, to do those scenes? It's all the boring stuff that you know, like you lift heavy things, you don't eat a lot of other things, you know. But what I didn't realize was just how many people it takes to make an action hero. You know, like, I, it looks like it's me, you know, doing all those things. And yes, I do, you know, some of it. But, an, you know, incredible stunt team, incredible special effects yeah. team. But your, uh, your arm, at one point, we see a shot of your arm and it's, it looks huge. <laughs> right. Where, did you bulk up more for this role than any other part before? Yeah, it's just, it was a very physical, yeah. you know, role. So there was okay. a lot of a lot of that stuff and, uh, you know, it was just a physical challenge in, in, in every way. We hadn't seen you on screen in a couple years. What made you want to come back with this movie and bring this action movie to everybody and what did you love about it? You know, I've always, Wanted to make an action film. I, they're what made me fall in love with movies. Yeah. You know, I, I just uh, took me a long time to find the right one. You know, um, 
this, and when I read this, I just thought this, you know, this, this is it. You know, it's, it's like the films I grew up loving. You know, it has like the 80s and 90s action films. It's, it's fun. Like the character has a sense of humor about the situations that he's in. Like it's, it's, it's an escapist uh, movie. It sort of had this, that, that tone that I, that, that I, that I loved. And, and I really liked the character. You know, I thought it was, it was like, you know, it was like a spy who doesn't want to be a spy, who'd rather be at home watching Netflix like the rest of us, you know. He doesn't want to have anything to do with this. He, just, he has to. And so it made it interesting, like, made him an interesting character to play.